Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Libra November 11, 2022. There is good energy for personal and family matters. Perhaps a new freedom is afforded you that feels good. Mercury moving to a square with Saturn can serve to remind you of the downside of a plan later today. Worries about the future, health, or knowledge are likely. There may be a mental disconnect with someone or a restless desire for more life experience cut short by the need to get critical work done. Alternatively, a block or obstacle may limit your choices or leave you uncertain about a matter. With Saturn involved, it's far better to put in the effort to fill your duties and responsibilities as best as possible than to fight it or take shortcuts. Otherwise, you may end up only spinning your wheels with little accomplished. While a negative skew can be a bit of a downer, it can also turn your attention to areas that need fixing. Destiny is whispering to you. A lunar eclipse in your solar 12th house appeared yesterday and will echo for six months. Use this time to listen to your dreams, your subconscious, and intuition. A profound revelation may appear in regard to your personal and romantic life. Focusing on privacy and rest may be a paramount concern at this time. Nostalgia and situations from the past may also emerge out of nowhere for you to face, especially in regard to how you've built your love life. You may now have a chance to heal, cleanse, find closure, and let go of something painful once and for all. What do you need to feel secure at work? It is time to feel secure in your unique desires when the Sun in Scorpio opposes Uranus retrograde in Taurus. Yes, it is easy to fall into the same old habits, routines, and methods. Why fix something if it is not broken? But you might be bored of the same old schedule at work, especially since this opposition encourages you to feel comfortable with an opportunity to stray from the usual status quo. You might feel just as, if not more, empowered by trying something new. So far this week it has been money matters that have been given a boost, with an eclipsing full moon helping to energize Pluto just as he ended his first month in direct motion in your financial sector. From today the focus starts to shift to the income side of the financial fence, though for now the focus is more on job and career matters. The aspect of the day will make you especially sensitive, take it easy on yourself. There will be challenges in how you see yourself versus how others want you to be. This is never a good feeling. However, you must not give in to feeling judged by other people's standards. Try to focus on your health as a means of determining your own personal boundaries. Make exercise and diet a priority this week. Helping others is a strong theme for this number, so don't be surprised if someone asks you for help today. Before you respond, especially if you are engaged in your own thing, be sure to think before you speak. It can be easy to snap at someone when they interrupt. However, they may be doing just that because it's really important. Exercise patience, 3, by hearing people out and lending a hand whenever you can. On the same day that Jupiter moves into his final two weeks in retrograde motion in your career sector, a friendly aspect between Neptune here and Venus, in her final days in your work sector begins. This comes on the same day that Mercury moves into his final week in your work sector, with all four set to become a tight unit over the coming days, amplifying a link between new job and untapped professional potential. At the same time, this is turning any tension from the lunar eclipse of the last few days into motivation. Yesterday it was Venus, the planet of love who reaches a point where she was just seven days away from your relationship sector and now it is Mercury, the planet of communications return. By this time next week, the first planetary activity on the relationship front since January will be underway and Venus and Mercury will be moving into an alignment that will put heart and mind on the same page. Our eyes in the sky. The morning kicks off with an opposition between the Sun and Uranus. Early on, use this energy wisely to power through paperwork, homework or any other mental activity you've needed to do, because your energy will decrease in the evening making you want to just chill and do nothing. You are in a position of great power. 
Make sure that you are earning the salary you deserve. Your talent and critical eye are worth a great deal. You have a solid reputation. People can count on you. You deserve a wage that reflects this. Even though the rest of the day could feel lazier than usual, the moon moves into Gemini, making it a good time to clean and organize your space. Turn on some happy music and dance your stress away while you declutter. Getting rid of stuff that you don't want or need makes room for new opportunities while also serving to therapeutically release stagnant energies and emotions. It is quite obvious that you need to put in sheer, hard work in order to get what you want. One thing that may not be quite so obvious, however, is faith. Don't forget to have faith that what you are working on will be successful and profitable. Through tension and friction with a friend or loved one today, you are likely to reach a renewed sense of clarity. Through someone else's annoying criticism, light is shed on a difficult situation. Use this newfound clarity in the week ahead. The night blasts in with a lot of energy as Mercury and Saturn square off, so expect a change of heart for the better. This is the mystical CPR needed to get back on track so you can greet tomorrow morning with more energy. Just after midnight, the Scorpio Sun makes its annual opposition to Uranus in Taurus, an aspect that tied into the astrology of yesterday's lunar eclipse. At this time, sudden events prompt grand life changes. It's likely that we will interpret these incidents as threats to our ego and autonomy. This transit intends to disrupt our safety mechanisms so we stop relying on power plays to facilitate our evolution. But in the immediate, unexpected circumstances frustrate us, pitching us into reactive behavior. We assume that by fighting back using manipulation tactics we can assert our dominance and regain control, but this is an exercise in futility. Instead, consider what might happen if you accepted these events as harbingers of personal advancement, cosmic messengers that have come to liberate you from a predictable future. Going with the flow and adapting is better than clinging to a security blanket now. A new dawn is upon you. Light is suddenly being shed on an issue that was previously cast in shadow. Take advantage of this new beginning. You may have to change your position a bit in order to reap the full benefit of this exciting time. Before dawn, the moon sextiles Jupiter in Pisces, engendering emotional harmony. After a turbulent day, we are offered a reprieve. We are reminded that blessings are hidden within the most trying circumstances. On a subtle level, the universe is looking out for us. We can now see the necessity of change and recognize the good to be gained from a mass overhaul. That doesn't mean that we will like it. However, we will accept that we cannot stand still as the world continues to move around us and expect our situation to improve. 